see it from a different perspective, that's all. Burning and looting your own neighborhood may be misguided, but at least those people out there were trying to fight to change the system. Now, with all due respect, you're just trying to make a dollar off their pain. Well, Rev, I bet you know a little bit more about making dollars off of people's pain. You packing them in the church every Sunday, giving them a show, got them hooping and hollering. Yeah. You know what, Rev? The only difference between me and you is you collect your fee at the pew. I collect mine at the dough. Where, Miss Anderson? I guess now's a good time for me to let you know that I asked your daughter to marry me. <sighs> he asked me last night, got down on one knee and told me that he couldn't live without me. Sister, if you're going to marry this man, he disrespects our home. The Reverend? Oh, he's a comedian. He used to try to make it laugh. He's a really good man. He even goes to church sometimes. <laughs> Granted, it is for material, but I am there, and God knows my heart. Stop. I gotta go. Stop. He ties. Child, I think enough of you to introduce you to dentists and doctors and accountants. But no, not you. You want a whore with this coon. Oh, Sparkle. Um, Miss Anderson, I'm probably more of a Sambo. I come from time to time, but Sambo's my go-to. Baby, think more of yourself. I know you're worried about getting older. And who's gonna marry you? But get older, not desperate. Desperate? <laughs> I'm doing a whole lot better than you ever did. You know, just keeping a man is a whole lot better than you ever did. Ladies, please, I think... No, 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 Reverend. L let her get her attention. Seems like she doesn't have much else. Maybe this is a conversation. Me getting a good husband is not about me. It's about her. It's not my fault that she got knocked up at 16 and is still trying to convince folks that she's the perfect mother. Raise some good girls. Sparkle's gonna fall off behind you and be a little church mouse and make dresses. And if she's lucky, she'll be a preacher's wife. Dee's gonna be a doctor. And I'm just supposed to marry one? Funny thing is, maybe I could have snagged one if you sent me to school like these two. But instead, I was at home raising your kids while you were laid up in your own vomit. Sister, if you're gonna tell my tragic story, give me the honor of getting it correct. I passed out a few times, sure, I've had my moments. But you've never, ever, ever seen me laying in my own vomit. Whatever you say, Mama. The fact is, I was desperate back then. But right now, I'm just trying to get myself the hell up out of here and get myself more than a color TV and half a room. No coming back. Not this time. 